Hello, everyone. Happy Saturday. This is Lady Baltimore coming at y'all. I'm at Supreme Sports. I'm about to do some working out and exercising. I just wanted to come to y'all before I started doing my little workouts because this has been on my mind about trying to avoid getting caught up in love triangles. I'm sitting there saying this because a lot of people sitting there playing around, playing games, sitting there playing mind games, confused, and getting other people involved in their mess when they just need to be real with themselves, be considerate of others, and just stop being negligent and having people caught up in their what Will Smith and Jada Pick was going through their entanglement bullshit. It is rough out here. People right now, they already going through enough. They already like right there on the edge from just being on first 48. Stop playing around with people. And know the signs. Know the signs when somebody's playing around with you and trying to keep you involved in a love triangle. Know the signs. All this shit about, oh, we co-parenting and shit, but every time I turn around, y'all on the phone, y'all hanging out, but y'all just co-parenting. Y'all can keep it, like, simple. If it don't have nothing to do with the child, it's supposed to be simple. Y'all should not have a whole phone, a full-blown relationship outside of whatever has to do with the child. All this other shit, oh, your ex-wife, even being in a situation where somebody's saying they separated. They married, but they're separated. Don't get caught up in no bullshit because if they was really going to be divorced, they would have been got that divorce. Don't get caught up in no love triangles. People, people will sit there and play with your emotions and read the signs. It's a form of disrespect. If you claim you're not in an intimate relationship with somebody or emotional, you should not have a full-blown relationship with somebody. I shouldn't have to question your relationship. Be careful with these love triangles. Because people will play you, play you out just to keep you around for a backup plan. And then when shit, when they feel as though they don't need you no more then you're out of there. The same person that you've been questioning when your intuition was sitting there telling you, it's more, they more than just friends or co-parenting or, or ex-wife or husband. It's something going on. When your intuition is telling you something, believe it. People will try to play you out. Don't wind up on First 48. Don't do it, shorty. Hit like and subscribe. I'm going to come at y'all a little bit later on with some workout videos. And I'm going to be juicing. I'm Later on, I'm going to be juicing. I'm going to show y'all what type of vegetables and fruit I use for when I juice. Yeah, don't, don't, don't let these people... Most of the time, you know something is up. They'll sit there and try to drag you along for a backup for a just-in-case. Knowing damn well they're playing with your goddamn feelings until that other person give them the good, the okay, okay. They be sitting there looking tinkered stupid. Don't do it.